Erin Blasky here, and this is another app demo for Ethusiasm. And the app I'm, I'm going to demo in this particular video is one called Sleep Cycle. Now you can see it right here on my iPhone. And Sleep Cycle is actually a pretty neat app. Let me just load it up here. What it does is it basically tracks your sleeping patterns um, over the course of every single night, and it gives you statistics. So if I load up my statistics, I've only tracked uh, probably, I don't know, three or four different nights. Um, but you can see here, this was the 29th to the 30th. I went to bed at 2.07 a.m., woke up 9.38, uh, total time sleeping, seven hours, and my average total time sleeping over four nights is six hours. So if you look at uh, the chart, you can see that um, there's times throughout that, that particular uh, area where I might get restless or, or whatnot. If I look at some other dates here, this one you can see there was a lot of, um, a lot of movement. This one, very spiky. And this one was probably the most accurate. So awake until I fell asleep, and then then you can see it sort of like dead sleep and then awake again. So how does this work? What you do is uh, basically you take your um, Sleep Cycle app, once you've downloaded it onto your iPhone, you uh, take the app, you open it up, just like I have it here. You want to first do a test. So you want to um, press start, lay it down on your bed face down so you want to actually put the screen on your bed it's not to be covered up by any pillows or blankets or sheets you just lay it basically on the corner of your mattress um, I usually like to put it just up to, up next to my head because I also use my iPhone as an alarm and this thing has a built-in alarm so um, you can select a sound uh, so whatever you like to be woken up by in the morning you can select that and then also the alarm, you just choose whatever time you want to wake up at. So it's just a matter of scrolling through the, the time and setting it. Once you hit start, it's going to tell you, I'll show you what it does. It's going to show you that um, pressing the home button will stop the alarm. You're not supposed to lock it. You're not supposed to put blankets over it. Place it with the glass side down and keep it charged at all times. Once I do that, it's going to start this lovely little um, screen. And this is where I would flip my iPhone over, and the screen's going to go black. Once I'm done, I wake up, and I can press my home button to finish. If you wake up early, you can just go ahead and press the home button. It's going to close the app, but that also just means it's stopping. If you, let, if you wake up when you're supposed to, it'll actually then show you the st statistics of that particular sleep. So that's the Sleep Cycle app. It's kind of cool. I mean, it just kind of um, lets you uh, look at sort of your sleep average and, and what kind of sleep quality you're getting. Um, there's, uh, there's another app that's coming out called WakeMate, if it's not already out. That one um, looks like it's a little more advanced. It actually has a, a, an armband you wear and things like that. But this one's kind of neat just to track how much sleep you're actually getting on average. So leave me a comment if you use this. Um, if you don't, download it, try it out. Uh, but uh, I look forward to hearing what you think about it. All right? For more reviews just like this one, just go to enthusiasm.com.